And welcome back to the high school football game of the week on WHVL. Steve Penstone coming to you live from Memorial Field at Bellwood and his high school, where tonight it is the 76th backyard brawl. Backyard brawl, there we go, between the Tyrone Golden Eagles. They will be in white. And the blue and gold Golden Eagles, or I'm sorry, the Blue Devils of Bellwood Annis High School. And uh, Tyrone a little late coming out of the locker room. Not sure if that was a little psychological ploy on the uh, part of head coach John Franco. Really no uh, secrets between these two head coaches. Uh, John Franco in his 24th season at Tyrone and uh, Coach John Hayes in his 30th season here at Bellwood Annis after being an assistant coach at Tyrone for 10 years. So uh, as the captains meet at midfield, uh, there is, as I say, really no secrets between these two coaching staffs. And as uh, Kerry Naylor said in the pregame show, uh, these kids know each other, the uh, fans know each other, and uh, everything is kind of left in the parking lot as uh, these teams battle it out for the 76th time. And, of course, uh, both teams last season finished with 10-2, and two, but... The big game, which was at Tyrone, was uh, won by Tyrone 76, uh, 27 to 6, and uh, Tyrone outrushed Bellwood Annis 237 to 114, and uh, had a decided edge in the passing game, 148 yards for Tyrone, just 10 for the Blue Devils. So uh, again, as Kerry Naylor said, usually the uh, the winner is the one that can establish a ground game early and often, and uh, just looking at the depth charts. Tonight, you have to give the edge to Bellwood Annis with Zach McCauley, the senior, 5'10", 180-pounder, getting the start at tailback uh, for the Blue Devils. Last season, he racked up 1,200 yards, 1,200-plus yards, 6.4 average per carry, and 100 yards per game. He scored 21 touchdowns. On the other side, it is Shane Walker, the senior, getting the start for Tyrone. And last season, he had two carries for no yards. All right, Tyrone will receive after the coin toss, and they will defend the end zone to our right here in the first quarter. Elwood Annis will defend the end zone down to our left. Packed house here tonight, as you can see, and the uh, fans ringing the field here at Memorial Field on just an absolutely perfect night to open the high school football season here in Pennsylvania, the first of our... 10 weeks of high school football on WHVL TV and uh, really couldn't have picked a better game to start it off with with this backyard brawl between these two longtime rivals. Coaches getting their uh, teams together on their respective sidelines. And we are moments away from the opening kickoff. Nate Plummer, the senior quarterback for Bellwood Annis, he'll wear number 12, and uh, he will also uh, handle a lot of the kicking duties. In fact, he was a first-team Northern Conference punter last season, and he will uh, handle the kickoff tonight for the Blue Devils. Deep to receive is number nine, Nick Patton. He stands at his own five-yard line. There's the whistle, and there is the kickoff, and we are underway. Patton fields it on a hop at his six. Cuts to the right side. And he's out over the 20 and brought down at the 21-yard line. So that'll get rid of some of the butterflies. And let's set the offense for Tyrone. Levi Reihart is the senior third-year starter. Last year he threw for over 1,400 yards. Ten touchdowns, was only intercepted twice. Mentioned Shane Walker. He'll start at the tailback position. Zach Galt is the senior. He'll be at fullback. Eric Desch and Nick Patton will line up as the wideouts, and they both split wide to the left. And we'll give you the offensive line after the first play from scrimmage. Adam Bonsall is the center. There's the snap. And off the middle, straight up, straight up the middle to the uh, 24. For a gain of... About three yards, and that was Zach Galt with the first carry of the night. 
move the ball out to the 25. That'll be a gain of four for Galt. Brings up second down and six. Mentioned Adam Bonsell, a senior at center. Tyler Hertzler, a senior, and Mark Bryan, also a senior at the guards. Keegan Fink, a senior, and Tyler Hertzler, or uh, Jared Templin, rather, a junior at the tackles, and D.J. Cherry is the tight end. And our first passing attempt is complete. Nice pass by Reihart. And that pass moves the chain, so our first first down of the night. Moves the ball out to the 33-yard uh, line. Ball spotted on the near hash mark. Two receivers splitting wide to the far side of the field. I formation behind Reihart. He checks the defense. Motion man is Desh, and we got our first penalty of the night. Well, that's to be expected. Ball start against uh, Tyrone. We'll back him up five yards. And move the ball back to the 28-yard line. So first and 15. Opening minute of play here, no score. Take a look at the defense. Quickly, we'll get it on the uh, next huddle between the two teams. Here's Reihart under center, Adam Bonsell. Again, the I formation, same formation as the play before. And off the uh, draw is Shane Walker, and he is uh, stacked up at the line of scrimmage. Gets back to the 30, just over the 30-yard line. So no gain on the play. Oh, check that, they're gonna make it a uh, two yard gain. So it brings up second down and 13. And as Walker gets his first carry of the night for two hard earned yards. Tackled by uh, Zach Doyle, a big senior, 6'2", 265 pounder, one of the offensive linemen for Bellwood Annis. Reihart fakes it in the middle, rolls right. Pressure's on, he scrambles out. Now he's going to tuck it in and scrambles down the far sideline and ends up stepping out of bounds between the 35 and the 40. Good hustle by Reihart and a smart move to uh, realize he had no open receiver, so 